Everyone's talking about how to tackle violent crime, especially in pockets of St. Louis City. One possible idea, allowing Missouri State troopers in to patrol in the area, but that is bringing back some deja vu for people who say the plan didn't work the last time around. News 4 investigative reporter Lauren Traeger went to city leaders to get answers. Time for talk is over. Today we've come together to take action. Back in 2017, then Governor Greitens, in the midst of a crime wave, sent a surge of state troopers onto St. Louis's interstates. Fast forward to now, and the idea is back on the table. What happens on these highways, they, they need to be patrolled as well. Mayor Leiter Krusen says, among other resources, she's asked Governor Parson for troopers to patrol not just interstates, but exit ramps and even state roads like Natural Bridge and Graboy. The governor at a meeting in the city Tuesday said it was one of several proposals being discussed. The bottom line is how do I protect those children out there from getting killed in the streets every day. If the goal here is to uh, improve public safety in the region, that doesn't mean more police stopping more people. But in 2017, the Highway Patrol plan faced criticism from some people, like the Arch City Defenders, who said troopers primarily issued traffic tickets. A News 4 investigation found that in two months in 2017, troopers made 130 felony arrests, more than 630 arrests for outstanding warrants, and 67 DWI arrests. And they issued more than 4,500 traffic tickets, too. Do you see them having a different role this time? Well, I know that they did issue some speeding tickets, but they issued a lot of other tickets as well. I mean, there are guns and drugs that run on these highways, and, and they sometimes exit those highway ramps and go off into our neighborhoods. And so it is a, a wide spectrum of things that the highway patrol would be patrolling for. Another hiccup the last time, the circuit attorney's office refused to prosecute the traffic tickets, saying they were basically an unfunded mandate, leaving them in legal limbo. So we asked the prosecutor, are we kind of back in that same boat? That's a good question for the mayor who asked for the highway patrol and, and the leaders around that table. You have to ask yourself, as the prosecutor of the city of St. Louis, do we deal with tickets? Ultimately, the issue was worked out back then, with the municipal prosecutor taking the tickets instead. Either way, with the idea being floated again, Democrat gubernatorial candidate Auditor Nicole Galloway says troopers alone won't work. In no way does this solve the problem of gun violence in our communities. There needs to be a debate about common sense gun safety measures in this state. We spoke with Governor Parson's office about the highway patrol plan. A spokesperson told us the governor recognizes that's something that could be done, but there is still discussion on what would be the most effective and efficient way to do that. Now, certainly no plan has been finalized yet, and there are lots of other proposals on the table, including funding in the city for social service programs and even for better technology for policing. We will certainly keep tracking the plans. I'm Lauren Traeger, News 4 Investigates. Brand new video.